And welcome back. A couple things to note. Um, one, you can't see me anymore. <laughs> a little bit of a. Uh, basically, the camera is more the trouble than it was worth. This is just going to make things a lot easier. Um, you don't need to see me anyway. You just need to hear me. Uh, you get to see more gameplay this way. I like it. It's a benefit. So I think... I just want to double check that I got this. Oh, I missed it. Okay. But yeah, I wanted to see how the first one worked out. It didn't come out exactly as good as I'd liked it to. So this is just going to be the better way. And I'm still playing around with, with audio levels. <clears throat> we'll tweak it. We'll get it right. Um, before we move forward, I think we got 500 souls. This would be... Maybe we'll do... Alright, let's do one thing first, and then we'll do this. Alright. So, one thing I want to grab is these soul items. Or, uh, these items. Here. One's a ring. That guy's gonna throw some fire bombs. I just let that happen. Alright, let's get out of here. Use an Estus. Okay. We're gonna grab this. Okay, now he checks that. We gotta run. Oh, ah! Oh my god. That's always the scariest. Okay. We're gonna run along here. I hate this. I'm afraid of heights, so this literally scares me. <laughs> I'm not even joking. This part. Uh, I have to, like, run along the edge. So that was the Ring of Sacrifice. Uh, basically, the way that works. Okay, hang on. I have to... Oh! He came down. Oh, this is not good. Alright. No! That's okay. <laughs> Next time, we'll kill him first. Um, that's hilarious. Basically, <laughs> the Ring of Sacrifice. Perfect uh, way to bring this up. How it works is if you put it on, you can go and reclaim your souls. So say, I didn't want to lose, I had a bunch of souls on me, I didn't want to lose them. Put the Ring of Sacrifice on, go and grab your souls. If you get your souls back, awesome, take the ring off. If you didn't, and you die, instead of, uh... Instead of you losing your souls, the ring breaks. You get to keep all your stuff. You're still dead, but it's uh I'm gonna kill these guys first. Not that guy though. This guy will ambush you. Try to go for the other guy first, even though I didn't smartly come over here. But I'm dead. Firebomb. Okay. Let's this guy I like to uh, throw out to he has his weapon. You also don't have to go right to the edge that way. This guy, hold up your shield. Okay. Now, one more guy down here, and then we're safe to get our souls back. Next time, just the easy way to do it. Like, I hate this jump. Now I have to do it twice. Or, like, even more. But, yeah. Just always kill all the guys in an area. It's gonna be so much easier on your life. Trust me. Oh. Now, don't also have your shield up when you're trying to run. I'm pretty sure it won't work. So, run, and then... Oh! Oh. Grab our souls. Alright. Now, there's not much room, but we have to run. Jump. Pretty, pretty tricky. Alright, let's just run up here real quick. One more item to get out of the way. Okay. 
Okay. Now. We have a bunch of souls. And we could level up. They can poison you. And they can also drop humanity. That's pretty lucky. Not gonna lie. Um, if you get your humanity level up to 10, you have the best item discovery, except for like a ring changing that. Um, and then you you can pretty much farm rats for humanity, which is my favorite way. I'll show you all the farming techniques as we go. Um, so let's see. I think what I want to do is use these souls up. Well, actually, endurance, because that can actually minorly help us in this next moment. So what we want to do is go to... Uh, let's get... Actually... Smart. Okay. <clears throat> Put that there. Let's go down. Down, down, down. Down here. Um, now we're gonna do <coughs> a strength build. She can't talk. For the most part, uh, strength and pyromancy. We're not gonna do any magic at all, really, except we will prepare ourselves to have a good start for magic in a new game plus. So that's the goal. New game plus, it'll be probably more fun to bust out some magic and use that to level up with. Alright, so when we come down here, we're in a new area. And it is not the area you want to go to right now. It's very, uh, deadly. But... If you come over here, talk to this guy. Don't mind this hollow. They're not gonna hurt you. Hmm? Well, this is unusual. You haven't lost your head. And more importantly, you're free. How on earth? Well, I shouldn't cry. I'm Ricky of Vinheim. I was once an established smith, but look at me now. Can you believe? Be careful. Um. Hmm? Have you? Oh no. Don't worry. I have no intention of escaping. It's safe here. I can't bear the thought of going hollow out there. Although, I must admit, there's not much to occupy myself. How about this? I could forge your weapons, albeit with rather minimal tools. I'll show you what made me the best in thing. So eventually, he will be able to uh, put magic on our weapons. It's alright. I don't use it too much, really. Let's repair our stuff. Well, we can. It's cheap. And it's a way to use our souls up, just in case we die. Uh, doing what we're about to do. Um, and yeah, he has sorcery stuff, which Goodbye, then. we don't Keep want. Head on or need this playthrough. Really New game plus. Okay, so. This is gonna be a scary run, not gonna lie. I'm gonna pull out our bones, because. Once we get what we need here, we're gonna pretty much bone out uh, immediately. Yoink. Fantastic. Not bad. Alright. So this is not gonna be easy. I'm not gonna lie. I'm kinda scared. I'm just gonna kill you real quick. I'm just gonna push you. 
Oops. Wrong button. Oh well. Nice. Okay, so that curse stuff is actually how you can attack ghosts, which we're about to see over here. Now, <laughs> if you're smart, you just won't come over here yet, because it's not... Oh, I don't have the... <gasps> I don't have the rest of the ring. I'm gonna go slow. Oh no, we're fine. Oh, oh, it's already begun. Okay, go quick, go quick. Uh, through here. And then there's a bridge, so you gotta be careful. Oh no. Yes. Bone out, bone out. Bone out. Oh, that's okay. We lost the render swords. I'm not worried about it. Um, literally, we're gonna let those go. They're gone to us. You could've used your ring of sacrifice there, if you really cared, but... There's nothing to care about right now. All we wanted was the item. We got the item. And actually, yeah. We didn't even have to use a homeward bone. It's actually kind of better. There's no difference. 300 souls is cheaper than what it would cost us to get a homeward bone. Alright, I'm happy with that outcome. So, uh, what we can do now is we didn't have any humanity or nothing that's perfect all right this is well worth it come down here talk to her now and you can actually reinforce our this flask awesome so now if you see at the bottom there it says Estus flask plus one that is perfect that means our Estus flask is better it's going to do more healing that's what we want now, the smart play would be to do Undead Berg now. So let's go back up here. Woo. Over here. Down here. Okay, deal with these guys again. Every time you go to a bonfire, all enemies will respawn, unless certain enemies won't, but um, bosses won't either. But, yeah, keep that in mind. Uh, it's good for farming souls. Just the type of person who wants to go through an area a couple times to get used to it. It's probably a smart call. So this is what you should do for this area. Come around here. Now for this guy, we can do the hard strike, kill him in one go, same with this guy. Woo! Always be careful, once again, with the lock-on, because he can really mess you up. Just making sure there's nothing back here I forgot, no? Okay. Let's go up here. What's that sound? Weird. Okay, that's still alive. Let's try an upward. Yeah. Okay, let's carry on this way, and I believe this gate is locked right now from the other side. I'll show you that. Yeah. We'll come back and unlock that very soon. Until then... Doo -doo -doo. Up here. Undead bird. Alright, be careful. Ah. With enemies teaming up on you, what you want to do for the most part is literally have them separated. So you want to kind of pull them away from each other. Ugh. Sorry, I'm just getting used to the controls on this new controller I got here. Alright, so let's... This, and also ambushes. Usually they're obvious. <clears throat> just ask this real quick. So this guy, I'm going to lure him over because there's another guy waiting if we do it, uh, where he wants us to. This guy here. And that's a deadly attack. Um, is there anything in here? Boxes. <coughs> Stuff like that. Barrels. Roll. And they'll break apart. Uh, 
Okay. So before we go in that fog gate, what we're gonna do is we're gonna come and use our rolling button that we just learned. Come down here, grab the soul item. And then be careful as you come down here. As you'll see, it's an ambush. Okay. Now. Come back. That's the trick that causes the ambush. Ah, I can't get back up the stairs, so I'm just gonna kick these guys out. And then... Okay, now, I'm not really taking my time. I'm rushing, which I shouldn't do, because I shouldn't show you that. It's bad habits. But, in this area, it's okay. Uh, not much to worry about, especially with our Estus. We're fine. Now, see that item down there? I gotta get that one still. I'm trying to remember how. We will get it though. We will. Humanity. Very good to have. Um, what's that? Alright, let's go to the fog. Through the fog. Definitely something over here. Soul item. Let's go upstairs. Okay, so if you look here, it looks like you can almost jump to it. No. Don't bother. You can come close, but you won't. Um, hello. It's the kite dragon. We'll get to that. Um it's not gonna hurt you right here. Careful of the archer. Always have your shield out. Whoa. Okay, okay. We're getting double teamed. Let's get back up. Estus, we don't wanna We don't wanna go back. Fire link at this point. We're almost at our next bonfire. It's gonna be oh he already came out. Okay. Now, if you open this door, come up here. It's a wooden shield. Alright, let's go up here and kill this archer. to light this one yet, but I want to show you how to do this, just in case you need to, from this bonfire. And actually, while we're here, level up uh, Vitality, so we're at 13 Vitality and Endurance, and that's our focus right now, is leveling up Vitality and Endurance. Vitality is going to raise our, uh, oops, health. And um, the endurance will improve our movement speed and our stamina, which is critical. It makes us run longer. It uh, makes us attack faster, longer. Get around faster. It's just great. Oh, I hate that move. All right, dealt with him. So once those two are dead, Come down. 
this guy's gonna be ambushing you. You don't want him from behind. And that was another thing to note with this game. Take your time, take it on the enemies. I know you don't wanna like always have to do it, but for the most part, it's better to clear an area out and uh, be safe than rush around and have a bunch of them running after you and stuff. This guy will not give me an opening. All right, another thing you can do is kick him and that's your opening if they're just not giving you an in because otherwise you're just going to hit the shield and it's going to do nothing. There we go. So once those guys are dead, as you can see, there's a little path down here. Take these stairs down. And this guy. I'm try to mess your day out. Take him out. And. Just want to make sure. Yeah. Alright, let's do this first. <laughs> if you come out here, on this balcony, you'll meet our friend. Well, now. You seem to have your wits about you. Then you are a welcome customer. I trade for souls. I'm here. Oh, yes, yeah, so I thought. Sorry. Well, now, you're saying? You seem to have your wits about you. Then uh -huh. you are a I trade for souls. Everything's for sale. This guy's really good <laughs> early on, and then he's useless. But for right now, very useful. Um, seriously, though. A uh, couple things we're going to need from him. One mostly being the residence key. So let's grab that. Uh, first, we gotta come down here so we can get enough souls. Well, we could just use our soul items, but still, get more souls. Alright, come on. You want to do it together? Okay. Let's do that. Oh, did you drop something? Broken sword. Not great. It's up here. I think it's another soul item. Yeah. Throwing knife. Nice. Alright, so this is the part that I was talking about where now we can make that jump. Crossbow, standard bolt. Alright, so that's good. We have a crossbow bolt. Um, yeah, let's just do it the safe way. <laughs> or we could. Okay, yeah, we could come this way. Whoa. Yeah, almost died there. Let's let's not. Let's come down, use an Esther. Play it smart. Get rid of you. Yeah. Okay. We're good again. Now, what was that other one we were missing? Is that it? Let's see. No. Hmm. I'm trying to remember how to get that one. And they're all coming for us. Um, let's just run down here quick. See if I did in fact... Oh! Miss it. Yeah. Okay. Alright, so we got that one. I'm trying to get all the items. Um... Yeah, there you are. I knew you were around here. Also, you can see... Yeah, which is coming because they're oh, Jesus. Let's get out of here. That's the um, because we'll be hanging off of things. So it's a little bit of foreshadowing if you're paying attention. <clears throat> you can see stuff coming. Also, some of it's just 
obvious. Like, it just looks suspicious, if you ask me. Alright, so, carrying forward. Yeah, let's just run this time. And then, we'll fight them. This way. Safe. Always listen. You can hear things coming too. It's another smart way to stay safe. Listen to your surroundings. Okay. So we already killed the stuff, so we can just mosey on over here. Down here again. Alright. In the resonance key. What was that? Oh. Perfect. There's a lot of stuff you can grab. The repair box and the bottomless box are good to have. We don't need them right now. Um, basically, it allows you to put items away at the bonfire in the bottomless box. And the other one is the repair box, which allows you to repair items without needing like a blacksmith or a merchant. What we will want to grab from him as well, though, is arrows. Um, and let's do what we can now, which won't be much. Uh, now, do I grab large arrows or standard? I guess large makes the most sense. Uh. Maybe I'll just grab this and then do the rest next next soul run. Thank you kindly. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we'll do that. We'll come back here in a little bit because we're gonna go do a quick run. It's gonna get us some souls. Or should we do that next episode? Um Yeah, we'll carry on next episode, where we'll show you how to get that item down there. Alright, next episode. We'll carry on in the undead berg. Also, we'll show you how to get that shortcut. Ooh. Next time, on Dark Souls. Bye guys.